One of the most important reasons for pursuing direct democracy is to create less division. Now let's talk about how direct democracy creates less division than representative democracy. So what causes division? In most cases, it comes from left and right wing politics. You might feel strongly about one or two issues, so you decide to support the party that represents your views on these issues. The obvious problem is that when you decide to support one of these parties based on your one or two issues, you'll end up inheriting policy positions on a long list of other issues, and you might not agree with them. Regardless of whether you agree with them or not, you chose a side, and now you're seen to be a supporter of all of those policy positions. When this happens, people feel like they need to defend their party when their party does something stupid. And politicians feel like they need to defend their fellow politicians when they say or do something stupid. This is all happening because there's a small number of sides, and we all pick a side. If we use direct democracy, there won't just be two sides. Depending on how you look at it, there'll be no sides or infinite sides, because each of us as an individual will be our own side. Regardless of whether there will be infinite sides or no sides, we'll all be on the same side. The concept of infinite sides is just a reflection of the fact that we're all unique individuals with unique individual political profiles, and direct democracy allows us to vote directly on issues in a way that reflects our individual political profile. We all have a unique voting profile, and direct democracy allows us to express it. The reality is that we've reached a point in time where representative democracy no longer serves the will of the people and technology can solve the problems that made direct democracy impractical. That's why I created One Direct Democracy. It's a movement for upgrading the global democratic system by taking the power away from politicians and putting it in the hands of the people by using direct democracy. I've created the technology and a plan for how to make it work. If you're new to all of this, check out the links to my other videos in the description. Direct democracy is the purest form of democracy. Representative democracy is an outdated, blunt instrument. Thank you.